Hey, what up, it's your boy TPNL. Welcome back to another video, baby. Smash that like button, subscribe if you haven't done so already, turn your notifications on. We back up in this thing and we're getting right into it. The Realish TV presents Flag on the Play episode two. Um, appreciate everybody who be sending me the content. Let's get right into it. Um, episode five, my pot of balloon, the fine love is out now. Episode six coming soon. I'm on that editing vibe. And um appreciate y'all rocking with me. Click on some of the greatness in the uh in the um description and at the end of this video. What's wrong with you? I don't know. I don't know. Be okay. man, I don't like I don't like I don't like I don't like the intro joints. I like when the video start. There you go. You get what I'm about to say, but I don't feel like saying it. All right, here you go. Yeah. Oh, man, oh. Let me hear the beat drop. I mean the freestyle. I, I don't hate when the beat takes too long to come. Beat banging and I'm swinging and I'm jangling and I'm like bitch dancing like a stripper, bitch dancing like too short. But he still ball headed. We got the same down, four headed. Big body law, little body law, body body law, everybody body, master P now. And you know we just rapping in some baby dress. When they hit the shoulder, you can think you shit. The man got a whole fleece, bit free. Styling every time. Welcome to another tape of the flag on the flag. Little bit, what you got titty tape on? You got booby wooby tape? That's that tape that what that tape pull you up? Y'all know I'm seeing everything. What you looking like, Diffo? What you got going on? Let me, let me, let, let, maybe I just, so I pick, nah. I thought to myself, maybe I picked a, a bad freeze frame. Shorty face Welcome stuff. To another Look at this. Take the flag on the play, it's your favorite. <laughs> you look like in the movies when it be like the mad, the, the, uh, the, the little, um, the little mob boss, but you the female mob boss. You like the female king queen pin. I host by Kayla. I'm Unique Monet, the Panamanian princess. And I'm Mika. Holy shit, what you is a Panamanian? Taking the flag on the play, it's your favorite host by Kayla. I'm Unique Monet, the Panamanian princess. And I'm the Panamanian princess. <laughs> I'm Mika, the badass unicorn. Yep. The Mika, the badass unicorn. A unicorn, huh? Somebody tell me in the comment section what it mean, what it mean when uh, like somebody call themselves a unicorn. Yeah, see, let me see. It. Let me let me get this intro again. Favorite host by Kayla. I'm Unique Monet, the Panamanian princess, and I'm Mika the badass unicorn. Yep. Mika the badass unicorn. Before we Panamanian start. Panamanian princess. Baka style Baka. I gotta show homage to our partners at Calabash Barn Grill. Man, but look, bag and blow the whistle to show that you're not. All right, man. All right. All right. Okay, they sound like they're ready. We Can we have the first piece. contestant they come out, please? Buddy. Hello, hello. Hello. Hey, gentlemen. Hello. <laughs> oh, what is your name? She got a little kangaroo pouch on that thing. Please. Ooh. Hello, hello. You know what we serving hey, this whole gentlemen. episode. Kangaroo pouch with forehead. <laughs> hello. <laughs> what is your name and your age? My name is Charlotte, and I'm Char 35. Charlotte, turn around before we can see you, baby. You got that, you got that big ass wool covering your whole face. Okay, okay. okay. Look, we're gonna go right oh, into it. In your age. My name is Charlotte and I'm 35. Okay. Let me see what this 35 okay. looking like. We're gonna Maybe go right lying. into it. Okay. Is it okay for your spouse to be the little spoon in the bedroom? Yes. <laughs> and why? Any flat? Oh, y'all okay with being a little spoon? I'm okay with being a little. I like to get cuddled in hell sometimes too. Fellas, how y'all feel about being a little spoon? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, fam. <laughs> now see. Yeah, that, everything was good till he said something. Man, little manhood got too strong. You can't have them tight that jeans be too manly to get spooned up, fam. Now see. <laughs> I feel like I'm asking. Now that's a it. flag on the play. You 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 pushed it in there. Pause. Okay, so do you want to go see why? Yes. Okay, go ahead. Let's see. Uh. Hello. Hello, how you doing? I'm good, thank you. Okay, we're gonna this go three hoes is still crazy to me. Y'all don't need none of these people. You just need one people. Y'all need to alternate this or something. See why he threw the flag, all right? Okay. All right. Hello. All right, so give us your name, your age. Hoes, you still got it now. Each and why you threw you your flag. You still got it now. Flag. My name is Jay, I'm 43, and I threw my flag because everything big over here. We ain't doing no little spooning. <laughs> is that your only reason? Definitely. You sure okay. about that? That be arm um, ain't even matching up. Don't get spooned. I oh, do okay. the spooning. Okay. Lord. Okay. And if he didn't throw his flag, would you still date him? No. Damn. Lord. Okay. And if he did, didn't throw his flag, would you still date him? No. Why not? 
Mm -mm, something about him. He looks very toxic and too, I don't like too cocky. I don't like that. I don't like co overly cocky, cocky men. I don't like that. Is that all? That's it. Okay. It's nothing all else. right. Here Thank you. Shoes too big too. You gonna come back to me? Mm -hmm. Okay, so you don't like cocky men? Nope. No? Okay. I, mean, I don't mind. So I don't know. Something about the Panamanian princess. I don't know if it's that blonde wig, but that boy, them lashes, or just the eyeballs is open. I don't mind a little cocky, yeah. but too overly cocky. It's a little and I just, I, I go off for of ore mm -hmm. and, and energy, and it's something about his his energy. It's something about him. I can't, I don't know. Can't something about him. Can't on it. Yes. Okay. 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 Never judge a book by its cover. I understand you that. You right. Can. You know. Yeah. But. So my next question for you is: Are you a homebody or a city girl? Um, I'm actually both. You can only pick one. Okay. Uh, then I'll say yeah, a homebody, a city homebody. girl. Here. Okay. okay. So to explain, I love to be at home. Mm -hmm. I love, you know, I'm a tourist. Mm -hmm. So most okay. tourists, we love to, you know. Bruh. We have a oh, flag thrown. We got a flag. <laughs> I should have said that zodiac sign. I should have. My dumb ass zodiac. I'm a Taurus. Okay. There the sign. Go ahead and go. Ain't no way that's 34, <laughs> fam. <laughs> Ain't no way that's 34. It was a I already know why. I already know why I threw it. But come on, we're gonna take this walk. Okay. Y'all gotta hit it. You gotta to to to. To be on this show, you gotta be over there. Then if you wanna go down the line, you gotta hit that stop sign, make right at the light, and then she gotta pick you up and then walk in. There. <laughs> Please give us your name, your age, and why you threw your flag. Uh, my name is Kimazi, I'm 22. And you said why? Why did you throw your flag? Oh, she's Probably because he's 22. Because she, she said she a Taurus. I knew it. What's wrong with us? I'm sorry, you toxic. Who's trying to? Oh, okay. I can't. Wow. Oh, okay, <laughs> you got me. Be you right? I can't be. I, I'm right. Being honest, I, I said I can't be. I said I knew what you sure. If you don't mind me asking, are you gonna hate me? I'm a Gemini. Oh cool. yeah, yeah. You're toxic too. Yeah. I know I'm not toxic. No, you are. I'm very, very. I dealt with person. a few of y'all, and y'all very toxic. No, I ain't never yes. been toxic. Dead okay, in my life. say what you want. That's fine. And if he wouldn't have thrown his flag, say what would you, you still date her? I would. Oh. So the toxic don't even matter. Boy, 22 <laughs> though. Because I'm toxic, remember? That's 12 years. <laughs> 12 years, she said she's still down with the get down. Damn, what you doing, host? <laughs> Getting that walk back. Y'all need to go ahead and put both of these hosts in the lineup, fam. Stop playing. Because <laughs> look at my dog I caught looking at the yams right there. Look, he caught. Because I'm toxic, remember? <laughs> That's Dredd. Dredd took a peek right there. He peeking. Buddy right here in the brown. Buddy right here in the brown. <laughs> Yeah, I'm about to mess shit up. Buddy, right here in the brown pee. Okay, Everybody so taking no a toxic sneak man. Peek. <laughs> so, <laughs> so next question, next question. If your man decided to be vegan and it was a deal breaker for you to be vegan or not, would that end the relationship? No, it wouldn't. Okay. Only because I, you know, I have my issues with, you know, trying to work out and, you know, lose weight or whatever I'm trying to lose. do, like better my health. Okay. So meeting a man that's vegan, he's showing me, he's leading the way to show me, you know, yeah. to, to have a be better okay. health, I guess. You okay, know, so I like say. that for you. Yeah. Okay. So what do you feel like your role is in a relationship? Um, my role is in a relationship as a woman, mm -hmm. I would have to say, um, first and foremost, catering to my man, mm -hmm. to his every needs, mm -hmm. you know, being respectful. And just doing what I need to do as a woman, just being there for him, even like when times are down for him, having his back. Okay. Yeah, having okay. his back. We like that. Yes. We like that. Yes. Okay. So look, oh, go ahead. Go ahead. You got one? Go ahead. <laughs> yeah. So in, in adding to that, do you know how to cook? What? Ooh. <laughs> what? Okay. Okay. Yes, what's, your, what's, your, what's your favorite dish that you like to cook? Um, honestly, I know salmon is like under, like oh, well, overrated, but mm -hmm. I love to cook me some salmon. I love salmon. I can do... Um, Shrimp and chicken, Cajun Alfredo. Okay. Salmon. I mean, lobster tail. Salmon. Whatever it is, you name. I can cook. Like they I like promise that. you that. Yeah, yeah, I don't think you're going to get a flag on that one. What's your so, question back here? So look, we're going we're gonna to switch it up a little bit. I'm going to have you walk over with my co host. Okay. And we want you to throw one of the contestants' flags. Like, just. Oh, yep, you're going to okay. walk over and we want you to choose between the contestants we have. Yeah, I got you got to throw one of their flags. I wish I could say who I want. 
Hold on, hold on, hold on. Look. We have a flag thrown. Just that quick. So we you gotta, gotta come okay, over. Go ahead and come on the flag was thrown. Man, I'm like me. All right, so we're gonna take a walk all the way down to the end. Oh, I hear it. That's crazy. Give us your name, your age, and why you threw your flag. My name is Derek Jackson. I am 34. I'm a Pisces. I'm from the DMV area. And I'm also an Aquarius, born 222. I threw my flag because I'm from the DMV area. Boy, I said my name is Derek Jackson. And I'm also an Aquarius, born 222. I threw my we flag no because <laughs> ain't no other choices around here. As you can see, for the most part, I would have thrown it when he threw it because the whole time you said But let me cut you off. It's crazy because I was going to throw my flag at you. That's fine. So, you know, you threw your flag, but it's okay. I threw it because the whole time beggars can't be choosy. And you're right. That's cool. There you go. Yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> and if he had not thrown his flag, would you still date him? I would. Okay. Yes. Pisces for the win. You know. Come on, Pisces. That I got you body too. You said personal training, vegan, right? I don't even die. I eat what I want. Okay, I like and that. You know how to you. cook, so I do like that. I like yeah. that for you. Okay. I had to throw that though. Well, nice to meet you. You can't choose. There's more women than it is men. Oh, okay. Going. All right. What? <laughs> okay. Okay. So we're gonna okay. walk down. You're gonna take the flag of the contestant that you do not choose. Okay. Okay. Let's do it. All right. And then the dress, I hate when these dresses, y'all wear these dresses and the print don't even line up with the back of the dress. They could at least took some time and line this shit up so the rows connected. <laughs> and why did you take his flag? Um, I'm not really attracted to him physically. Okay. Yeah. Is that the only thing? Well, I don't know much about him, so I can't speak on that. I'm just going off right now, um, physical looks. Okay. Yes. All right. So if she had not taken your flag, would you still date her? I would still date her. She's a beautiful individual. Thank I mean, you. I started getting to her myself as well, but Thank off you. of looks, I definitely approach her. Go talk to her. Okay. That. And you. your name, your age? I'm Steven. I'm 24, and I'm from the DMV area. Okay. Steve. All right. So it looks like we only have one flag left. <laughs> So my dog came walk down. to the dating show with shorts on, a brown shirt. I guess they gave you the whistle, but you got the J's on with ankle socks. That's diabolical. I can't really talk too much about too many people fits me. I just did my part to balloon to find love episode six and laid some clothes out and I ain't put that shit on, like try to offer them before I got done there. And I put them in clothes on. This might this is gonna be the worst outfit I've ever wore for Pop the Balloon. It, it was my the best episode, but my worst outfit ever. I was so pissed when I put this shit on, man. I was like, damn, this look, I look, I look terrible. Let's go. <laughs> Wait till y'all so, see that shit. All right. You have not thrown your flag yet. Give us your name, your age, and why you didn't throw your flag. Tyrese Williams, 24. And I haven't thrown my flag because um, I like to be nice, you know. Um, I don't have nothing against anybody, but um, yeah, I don't, I don't have anything. Okay. And then why didn't you take his flag? Oh, he's attractive looking. Thank you. Okay. So would you two say it's a match? No. No? I mean, we could be friends. I mean, so I agree. Friends, yeah. So would you keep your flag? And Nah, bro. He don't want to keep. Want to see what else y'all got going on? What's cracking? Oh, that's tough. That's he tough. Got it's Say not no, that bro. tough. Say oh no. wow. <laughs> he he really ain't want to throw that flag for real. He want to be like the rest of these men. He wanted to be like the rest of them, but that's cool. But he yeah. threw it. Yeah, it's so, all right. So because you threw your flag, why? Why did you decide to do, to throw it in the end? Honestly, I. I, I seen somebody. He doesn't even know why. <laughs> it's, his, his answer is, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't like I, now. See, I mean, because I don't. I don't like a, I, I don't know, know man. <laughs> like, what's wrong? <laughs> what's wrong with you? I don't know. I don't know. Be a okay. man. Speak up. Say what's really on your mind. Uh, you just, you just not attractive to me. Oh, now I'm not attractive to you. Wasn't that when she asked you that uh, question? You asked, uh, she, she, see, that's too much for me. You ever, you ever hear a woman see say some stuff like, oh, he can't handle me. Yeah, I wouldn't be a hell of man. That's too much. Speak up. You speak up. Oh, now you want to speak up? 
And hoes, you got to switch your hands. Put them cards in your right hand. Put that mic in your left. You, you doing that cross body. You got that great. You got that Tony the Tiger going. You got that when that Tiger Woods hit that golf, that you got that Tiger Woods cross body going. The first time, but OK. Thank you. All right, you ain't got no more flags. Wrap her up. And I think that's it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that was a little feisty over there. Yeah, that was that bull coming out. Oh <laughs> well, yeah, that was a bull. That's the toys. Yeah, that's 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 what it so is. Look, on the bar, I got we time appreciate for that. you coming yes. out. Sorry we couldn't Thank find you. For you yeah. So yeah. She was talking to that man like like next time. Thank like you so much. Like one her Thank kids you so or much. <laughs> talking to that man like that. That's crazy. Contestants, are you ready? Beautiful. Oh, Hello. Yes, sassy. Okay, tell me your lashes is crazy, bro. Those lashes is nuts. Oh, hello. Yeah. That is sassy. Mm, gotta go. Too much going on. Them lashes, tongue ring, no ring. Hey, tell me your name and your age. Tell me out. Hey, y'all. I'm Red Rum. That's my model name, and I'm 24. Okay, Red 24. Rum. So, question What's your definition of self love? Self love is when you take care of yourself. You don't need nobody else. Mm. Duh. Okay, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Miss Independent, Miss Independent. Very. So let me ask you: Is it a deal breaker if your spouse couldn't dress? Um, no. No. Okay. Okay. Mm. okay so is it a deal breaker if they have kids? Damn, I gotta get a freeze frame. <laughs> on okay. So that. is it a deal breaker if they have kids? Damn. But look at them lashes, bro. You gonna mess around and get pink eye, man. You can't have them lashes sitting on you like that, man. That ain't good and healthy. <laughs> <laughs> yes or no? Uh, what, 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 what? I don't know about that one. <laughs> no, you're not step I don't know. No step mom? We're going to say yeah. Okay. Not too many, though. Okay. I'm not 24. I'm young. Yeah. <laughs> okay. We travel. We have fun over here. Okay. We got, we booked them busy. City girl? No. <laughs> Nobody. So, yes. Oh. So let me, okay. so let me, city girl? No. <laughs> Nobody. <laughs> We booked and busy over here. We travel. Homebody, yes. Man, listen. The, the ones that claim to be a homebody and, and and put out there that how much they a homebody, how much they a homebody, I'm a homebody, I'm a homebody. The ones that say, I just go to work and I go home. Them be the ones that be outside the most late night, key under the mat. The ones that be, I'm an introvert, I'm an introvert. That's, it's cool to be an introvert. They didn't, they didn't make it cool and shit. You got to broadcast it to the world. Be out here getting... Slayed and flipped and flamboyed the most. Knock them ankles loose, baby. La bamba. The most. Be out here talking about I'm I'm celibate. I'm, if you gotta announce to the world that you ain't having sex, what? Why? What was you doing before? What made this announcement come about? Cook. So, yes. Oh. So let me okay. so let me ask you I'll this: Would you prefer a date on a beach or would you prefer a date in a city? Um, you want me to keep it a buck? I like both. Okay. I like both. Both. Okay. Okay, okay no flags yet. Okay, if you had one superpower, what would it be? Mmm. Superpower. Mm. To make it rain money. <laughs> oh, I like that one. I like that one. They like it, you too. Okay. So look, yeah. we're going to switch it up a little bit. Okay. We're going to have What's you that bag, yo? walk down with my co-host. That's not for love because yellow. And choose two of our contestants' flags to throw. Okay, so yep. I throw they flags. Yep, you gonna okay. choose. Yep. Go ahead and go over there to me. Uh, you ready? Yep. All right. Show me the oh, contestant. Yeah, she gone. So she that she wanna shoes. take their flag. Yeah. She got the big bird accessories. Oh, okay. And why did she you said, take it? Let his me flag? get that. Let me get that about I don't you. like the wicks. The what? The wicks. Don't they call them wicks? Yeah. Okay, what's the wick? Wicks. She don't like wicks. It's dreads, thick dreads. Oh, okay, okay. So that's why you threw your flag. Mm -hmm. Okay, and give us your name, your age, and if she hadn't thrown her flag, would you still date her? My name is Jay, I'm 43, and still date her probably not. She's too close to my daughter's age. Okay. Ain't throw the flag then. Okay, so we have one more flag to throw. Okay. Pick another contestant. Don't turn your back. Don't turn your back? Oh, because they're booty cheeks. <laughs> Don't turn your back. Yeah, okay. she's out. You're gonna Why get did a, you take he's his gonna back? He's going to get a demonetized. He, he is H. He looks what? He's his age. So it's age. 
Okay, give us your name, your age, and if she hadn't thrown the flag, would you still date her? Okay, my name is Derek Jackson, AKA Pretty Boy Hitch. Um, I am 34. And I also do a lot. Um, yes, I might date you because I've dated women younger, but that one thing about- younger than she talking about because she said, because she, she said, why did you throw your flag? She said, because he is his age, but he 10 years younger. Do you say, I think he said he's 42, 44, but he's 34 right here. Which I don't understand is that 24. men actually gravitate over age with time. When it comes to money, you said make it rain. One thing you don't know, I do make it rain. Oh. That's- this big guy, this big guy, a little attitude, don't he? It's fine. But yeah, you cute. But I guess we match a little bit, but not this match tonight. Yeah, not at all. What is he doing, fam? Blowing kisses and shit with the peace sign. You think you LL Cool J? And there we have it. Okay, so we still got a couple flags. So let me ask you some more questions. Okay. So. If you found out your spouse had fake jewelry, would that be a deal breaker? No. Okay. I don't care. Like, I got fake chain on right now. I don't care nothing about none of that. I care about materialistic things. Okay. Okay. Mm. Y'all mama done put fake jewelry on y'all when y'all was babies. Y'all know that? The first bit of jewelry 99% of y'all had on was fake. Your mama done took y'all ass to Claire's and uh, Pearson Pagoda. <laughs> I forgot about Pearson Pagoda. Got that little Pierce of Pagoda card. And they put them, they put them sterling silver, them, them, them diamonds wasn't real. They didn't put fake jewelry in your air and you was three months old. They ain't care nothing about you. Stop the cap. Okay, I kinda like that one. Mm. Well, I mean, what's your type of man? Um, I like someone who's like me. I'm very adventurous. I like to travel on the road. I'm a model, so I like to do a lot of things. Sometimes I like to turn up, but I like to stay in the house. I like to run my feet together and watch TV. Okay. Smoke a J, that's it, and drink a little wine. Okay, okay. So next question, what, what if your spouse did not drink or smoke? Would that be a deal breaker? No. Okay. What's your age range for a man? Um, so 40 was, that's a little too high for me. Um, unless you're trying to be a sugar daddy, but it wouldn't be nothing serious. <laughs> it wouldn't be nothing serious. Um, I would say... Being a sugar daddy is never anything serious when you have a sugar daddy. They give you money and you give them your body. A lot of, a lot of women think, oh, I just need a... I'm trying to be a sugar daddy. I just need a sugar daddy. And y'all be thinking... Y'all be hearing about this one this one time or this one case of the, the sugar daddy not even wanting to sleep with you. He just want to talk. Man, that's not happening most of the time. Most of the time, they trying to get with you before they even give you that money on. So please, ladies out there, I would not recommend you go out there and sell your body and be a prostitute. You know what I'm saying? I, I would not recommend that, but know, what, know what's coming with that. You know what I'm saying? You, oh, I want a sugar daddy. I want to be a sugar baby. Maybe I want somebody to pay my bills. You're going to have to give up some of that sugar. And it's all fun and games. To that man laying on you like like he was laying on Jada Pinkett in that Jada Pinkett in that movie, cutting that check. You got that big old sweaty wrinkled ass man, hairy, gray hairs on his balls, laying on you and stroking you out, kissing on you and stuff. You gotta kiss him back. You over there just looking at the ceiling, wanting to cry and melt through the sheets, not in a positive way. It, it, just think about it now. It's going. It's rough. And you know them flashbacks is them flashbacks. Our memory is. A, a blessing and a curse sometimes. But you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. Yeah. 30, 28. 28. Okay. Yeah. So four years older than you. Yeah. Okay. Just okay. a couple of years. Not too much, not too little. She okay. counted that shit out like so she's still in grade school. I would be a freshman, you'd be a senior or college, some shit. The contestants love you too much. Don't <laughs> no, nobody want to throw a flag. We're going to have you take two more flags. <laughs> I mean, we got to. Nobody's doing, they not budging. So okay. we're going to have you walk with my host and we're going to see. Either way. Oh, Damn. Yeah. Oh, okay. So tell me, why did you take his flag? Um, Hi. to be honest, he don't look like he can like handle me. So. Oh yeah, I'm out. I'm out again. I don't want him. Do you care to elaborate? Um, keep it a bug. I'm a lot, y'all. I'm aggressive, but I could be sweet at the same time. Like you got it's the best of both worlds. <laughs> cool. <laughs> <laughs> 
Okay, I'm coming. I'm coming. Okay. <laughs> so give us your name, age, and if she hadn't taken your flag, would you still date her? My name's Steven Roscoe. I'm 24 from the DMV area. And if she didn't pick my flag, I'd probably still talk to her. Be adventurous, so I'm into as well. We said I can't handle you, but you don't know I could go in my life as well. So I mean, could be nice little counteraction, but oh, okay. That's a and that's okay, a so and that's a man go, talking, walk. communicating, and expressing. Not saying I can, I'm a handle you. You know, you gotta be fellas. You gotta watch what you want to sign you up self up for. Some shit it look good, but it'd be a headache. You know what I'm saying? Be stressing you out. It don't be worth it. The juice don't be worth the squeeze. Oh, I need a man that's going to check me. Put me in my place sometimes. Ah. Ah. Down because a flag was thrown. Okay. And we're going to find out why. Your name, your age, and why you threw your flag. Uh, my name is Kimonte. I'm 22. And I threw the flag because she said, well, I don't look 22. You said four years, shorty. And he's just two under you. No, you're just too young for me. You said, oh, this is another example how women do not date around that age. Well, I could do four years older than me, but I'm not gonna do I'm not gonna do two years under me. You're 24, you're 22. You do 28, but you won't do 22. Oh, that's fine. Okay, but I threw the flag because she said, um, she all, said, and get your hair out your face, bro. This, that's crazy. Just having four, you got a bang. Almost like back in the day, back in the 90s, when a woman used to do that swoop and the whole eye be covered. I used to always wonder, and be, my, cause my mama used to do that when I was young. I used to always wonder how they were able to see. How can you drive? Yeah, uh, you can't handle me, but you should be a man's piece. You know what I'm saying? That is a problem. Mm. So, oh, no, I'm not a problem, baby. Well, that's yeah. what you made it seem I just like, like over there. I'm an aggressive person, so yeah. you gotta match my energy, nah. match my fly. Oh, okay, maybe you should. You can't worked. be sweet. You can't be soft, too soft. Okay, maybe you should have worded it a little different. I'm not trying to be. Man, unless 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 my lady into that, like you know, what I'm saying on, on some bedroom vibe shit, but I'm not trying to have to be aggressive with your ass around the clock. I'm like I'm, I'm good on that. Understood. All right, but she is cute though. Thank you. Okay. All right. So we have one contestant left that has not thrown their flag. We're gonna walk down. <laughs> Come on. Okay. Give us your name, your age, and why you didn't throw your flag. Tyrese Williams. I'm 24 years old. I didn't throw my flag because uh, I know her already. So um, I don't mean to do this though, but yeah. Okay. Dang. So now you're throwing your flag. And why are you throwing your flag now? Because we're cool, I already know her. So because you're cool, you don't want to date? That's uh, gang. Yeah, all right. Oh, no, okay. I, I, Anytime people say that's gang, you already know them. They already know their ways or, or one of the homies or, or one of her home girls. Somebody already knocked somebody down, already had some kind of, you know what I'm saying? I mean, it's up in the air. So maybe. Or they exchange numbers and somebody's communication is poor. Like she not replying to my texts, she not replying to my DMs. Look at this look on her face. All right. Okay, so we don't have a match for cool. this time, but maybe there's a next time. Mm -hmm. We're happy to see you. Appreciate you coming of out. Of course. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> what is this? What? The I don't know what you be doing. You be just We're doing a little see. weird shit sometimes. Yeah. Appreciate you coming of out. Of course. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> you got to watch this video back. And you got to look at certain stuff you do and fix it. The weird face and the gestures. <laughs> look, that, you holding that? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Contestants, are you ready for the next round? Beautiful. Hi, Sparkly. how are you? Hello. What's your name and your age? I'm Reese. I'm 30 years old. Okay, okay. Can... This thing looks like a trash bag or pleather. Just don't look. It just looks. I don't want to be mean. It looks very affordable. You got any questions for I got a question. So, how do you know when you're ready for a relationship? Um, where everything aligns, you know, if we're on the same page as far as like uh, morals and values, things like that, really vibing, the connection is there. Okay. Mm -hmm. What's a deal breaker for you in a relationship? Smoking cigarettes. Mm -hmm. So vaping. Man, we have awesome. a flag, flag. We got a flag. All right. So we're going to walk down to the contestant that threw the flag and see why he threw it. Okay. 
That boy be smoking. Okay, smoking. you're gonna give your name, age, and why you threw your flag. My name is Derek Jackson, aka Pretty Boy Itch. I'm 34 and I threw my fag because I actually smoke cigarettes, but I'm also a personal trainer and I'm a bartender and I work for every liquor company. But at the same token, I threw my flag just because Shut you didn't like that. But no offense. <laughs> oh! You get what I'm about to say, but I don't feel like saying it. So yeah, it's a lot of muscle in here. It's my off season. But you do look pretty and very attractive. I don't distinguish and don't discriminate, but cigarettes is my thing when I want to cope from actually all the jobs I have. Man, shut your ass up. We not about to agree with you smoking on them cancer sticks. Just say you smoke cigarettes, man. Nails probably, your tongue probably dry. Just terrible, man. Lungs cooked. Just cooked. Trying to get all, all these justifications for you smoking them cancer sticks. We don't care about none of that. Silence. Hey, which is 104. 104 jobs you yes. work. I work everywhere. I know everybody. Oh. We don't care. Nobody asks you about that. Okay, mm. that's interesting. I know. But you can still be fit and, you know, you can be physically oh, fit on the me, outside. I, I work in the medical so field, too. It's so the same lungs, as well. Yeah. So you can still have messed up lungs. And, oh, you know, no, I know. Definitely takes away from your... It's more tar build up and weed. Oh, okay. Just so you know. I don't smoke either, so that's that fine. wouldn't matter to me. That's cool. Get I his can do weed. Get I just his ass. I do like your Japanese Asian culture you got going. I'm in trying it. to stretch it up. Nah, but we talk about your ass smoking them cancer sticks openly and trying to brag on them and shit. Get your ass out of here, man. You the only one still smoking them cancer sticks. They at least trick the youth. They at least trick the new youth to to start vaping. Put it in a cool, colorful cartridge and made it flavorful. You still smoking them cancer sticks? Smacking that cartridge like this. Hey, you got a light? <laughs> that bitch smoking them camels in Newport's. Anime and stuff, but that's that's okay, another awesome. thing. So yeah, so I'm cool. I'm a huge Marvel fan, so okay. I'm in DC. A bit. They call me the Arrow. I just ain't got my hood on right now. Mm -hmm. Oh, nobody yeah, calls you. That's only my flag. Okay, Hawkeye smoke the Arrow, but okay, we ain't gonna go there. Deuces. If he had not, he loved giving somebody a deuces. I smoke the arrow, but okay, we ain't gonna go there. Deuces. If he had not thrown his flag, would you still want to date him? I gotta see this man line up. I got to see the ladies that's giving you attention. I gotta see him. Who, ladies, who, who, y'all giving this man, y'all showing this man attention? In these, in these DC streets, I gotta see who you walking around with, fam. Just off the anime aspect and that you are physically healthy and I'm like on the health journey as well. I don't go to the gym as often, but um, I do intermittent fast. Probably, probably we could probably see what it is. One more thing. Can I oh say? my God. Yeah, I got in a car accident right before this year started, right before Christmas. Mm -hmm. And I ain't been in the gym but two times. But at the same token, I drink plenty of water. So when you talked about the healthy mindset, yes, I'm very healthy and tuned. Okay. I'm also the designated driver. But Something else. You're not that okay. guy, pal. Trust me. Right. You're not that Let's guy. Go back. Okay, that was a nice little conversation. Yeah, I'm sorry, the flag, you know, went so down. Garbage. I the bomb. I mean, it was a bomb. It was a, it was a love bomb for sure. <laughs> so, what is your definition of the What's one? What's up also? with buddy? Are you too? Bond, it was, you might come out. Are you too stiff? Watch this little bounce right here. It was a love bomb Look. for sure. <laughs> what so is what, that? <laughs> what is your definition of the one or soulmate? Look at him, loosen up. Look how he looking at the girls and everything. Just loosen up, bruh. And I'm sorry, the flag, you know? <laughs> why, watch this bounce down. Down. I throw the bomb. I mean, it was a bomb. It was a, it was a love bomb for sure. So what, what is your definition of the one or soulmate? Mm, my soulmate looks like... Um, Someone that I'm she nodding like she said something. You mean she ain't said nothing yet, man? You ain't even got your nods down on the right timing. It looks like look, um, mm -hmm. someone that I am emotionally secure with. Um, that provides just stiff. Put your arms down, man. Has a certain physical safety and emotional safety for me. Um. Nostrils flaring. Again, just going back to the alignment. Like, everything just has to align with my soulmate. Come on, Chun-Li. Okay. Okay. So, if your spouse 
said he wanted to be celibate. Would that be a deal breaker? Um, so the longest I've gone without sex was like a year, eight months, and it was recently within like the past four years, so no. Okay. And if it's a Christianity um, based behind him, the celibacy, that's fine. Okay. Yeah. Okay. There are other ways to please each other. Mm. Mm -hmm. Um, what's your zodiac sign that you just cannot date? Ooh, girl. <laughs> You gotta pick one. Ooh, child, Gemini's. She about to get your balloon pop. I told you. I told you. We have a flag. Ain't he blew that whistle? We got a flag, baby. <laughs> My dog got on that okay. all Okay, you might already even know, but we're gonna go to walk down and see why he threw his flag. Okay, please, please give us. Damn, damn, the hoes got a limp now. Y'all got the hoes okay. doing too much. Okay, please, please give us. Yep, yep. Please give us your name, age, and why you threw your flag. My name is Kimonte. I'm 22. And she says she dudes. can't date Gemini's. I'm a Gemini. So I don't see what's wrong with us. You know what I'm saying? We good men. So uh, are, you, are you a May Gemini? No, I'm a June Gemini. Ooh, and my birthday coming up June 13th, y'all. So, yeah. <laughs> okay, turn up for the crazy guys. Okay. Mm -hmm. So if he had not thrown his flag, would you still date him? No, he's 22. You're so young. I gotta, you know, yeah, that's that's good though. But you're still 22. I respect that. Okay. Yeah. All right. Let's go. So we, we're going to switch it up, right? So we, we're going to switch it up, right? We're going to have you take two of our contestants' flags Ooh, that you're not interested with. <laughs> so we're going to have you walk over. Are you ready? Yes. Okay. You know who you're gonna pick. Damn, why they do my dog in the is it the outfit? Okay. So tell us why you threw his flag. Um it's a height thing. I'm always in heels, platform stuff. And like without this, I'm five four and a half, so I'm not oh, you know, okay. super tall or whatever. But it's a height thing. About okay. four inch, number All like right. three, four inch heels. So, so she five, four, so five. So, but it's so like give five, us your eight. name, your age, and would you still date her if she had not taken your flag? I'm Stephen Roscoe. I'm 24 from the DMV area. I say, if you ain't take my flag, I probably still wouldn't go for you. Just not really my speed right now. But I say height is kind of a childish thing to say. But I got a lot of other things to offer for you. You being that yeah. short is childish. That's I can't how really go too far into it. If that's your choice. It's your choice. Oh, it's subjective. He said I got a lot of uh, some cool other things to offer. Oh, that's sad, man. You know they keep doing okay. these little short. We have one like more this, flag man. that you gotta take. I don't like that. Oh, child. Come oh, on, not who child. Oh, child. Okay, let's go. Okay, that's a little bit. So why did you take his flag? It's, I'm not into hair. Sorry, I know that's super shallow, but I'm not into hair. So is the... Everything else is like, you know, you got the swaggy, you got mm -hmm. a young look. And then um, I also believe on a past episode, you say you were 40. Yeah. Okay. So oh, go ahead and give us your research. name, age. And if she had not taken your flag, would you still date her? My name is Jay, I'm 43. And if she wouldn't take my flag, I probably wouldn't date her. Why y'all ain't paying my flag? Just the way I like you gotta put things together with me. I'm more I pay attention to detail. So it's as simple as that. Okay, okay. Simple enough. So we have one last flag. This boy be holding this flag today. He wants some TV time. <laughs> <laughs> Give us your name, your age, and why you didn't throw your flag. Tyrese Williams, 20, 24 years old. I'm from Richmond, Virginia. And um Man, this is crazy. This whole video is just crazy to me. Because I don't like to be mean. I don't. Cause but I you like, haven't thrown your flag. I feel like I haven't. No. <laughs> yeah, I'm real nice, man. And you're I, the last I, one. I like, to get to, I like to get to meet people mm -hmm. to see for like who they are. Bro, what's up, bro? And, um, yeah, I'm just not the type to just assume. So you're the last one with the flag. You would you say it's a match and you would like to go on a date with her or would you still nah. like to throw your flag? Um, I'm gonna throw my you flag. seem cool, but uh, I just still throw my flag. Yeah. 
Okay. And if he had not thrown his flag, would All you right. still want it to go on out a date with him? Um, he's handsome, but it's an age thing. 24 okay. is a bit young for me. So knowing your age now, no. Bang. Okay. So All right. Lose a little while. Very. So, um, unfortunately, we couldn't find you, love, on this in, okay, on this taping. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> but we're gonna have you find you, love, on this in, okay. on this on this taping. Okay, taping. Sorry. Okay. Episode was hey. fine. <laughs> but we're gonna have you back. I appreciate you for coming okay, on. Thank, thank you for, for having out. me. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, this would be them scary movie smiles, bro. When they start smiling at you like that. Yes, you <laughs> Bye. Why y'all smiling and laughing like this, man? <laughs> oh, my. Hey, thank, thank you for, for having out. me. Yes, you <laughs> Bye. And it's the editor, too. The, the, at, at, this shit supposed to be edited out. Soon as she walk off, go show the lineup, watching her walk away. Not this little, little ass stalker scare right here. I feel like you little dog, baby. We crank you up in the back. We twist that little thing. You start to walk it like this. <laughs> oh, that's it. <laughs> I'll tell you that at this point, it's fun. Okay. Listen, man, we want to thank everybody for watching the episode. Yo, the lights. DMV area, you want to be on the next taping, make sure you send an email. Bro, there's too many people in the DMV area for y'all not get this thing jumping. We can say the same about South Florida. But I'm blacklisted. <laughs> Appreciate y'all rocking with me. Boy, you got some facial expressions on you, boy. To admin at The Realist TV. But look, we'll be right back with another episode. Somebody got to keep it real. Appreciate y'all rocking with me, man. Smash the like button. Click on some of the greatness on the screen. Y'all know the vibes already. Link in the description. Pin link. Everything link. It's all link. All right? Y'all be easy. Lay y'all like a play because I'm going to see y'all in the next one. Cheers.